busy weekend for Memphis police conducting 42 traffic stops, issuing 20 citations and making more than 21 arrests in just one night. Part of Operation Saturday Night Live, which we learned today is an ongoing effort to cut down on crime. Hello, I'm Stephanie Skurlock. And I'm Greg Hurst, but as WRG's Ashley Paul discovered, some of those who were targeted believe police took it too far. She joins us now live outside 201 Poplar after talking with one of those people arrested this weekend. And Ashley, what did he have to say? Steph Greg, 38 year old Earl Johnson is free tonight after spending 36 hours here at 201 Poplar this weekend, charged with a crime he says he didn't commit. I was at the wrong place at the wrong time. And that unfortunate placement, he says, is what landed him at 201 Poplar Saturday night. As I was making a little turn, I was sick. The first two lines was, uh, kind of had a lot of traffic. So I just got over to the right line, gave it a little gas, and the police stopped me. 38-year-old Earl Johnson is one of at least 22 people arrested Saturday night as part of what Memphis police are calling Operation Saturday Night Live. They say it's part of their effort to cut down on crime, specifically in areas where they receive a high call volume. The effort this weekend was focused in the intersection of B.B. King and Gayoso in the city's entertainment district. In addition to the arrests, police also issued 20 citations. I would like for people to be able to come and enjoy themselves without uh, looking at, uh, wondering whether or not they're going to be robbed, whether or not their car is still going to be there once they uh, go back to their car. Charges issued that night include everything from disorderly conduct and driving on a suspended license to more serious crimes like DUI, outstanding warrants, and stolen firearms. According to court documents, Johnson was charged with reckless driving for allegedly swerving in and out of traffic at a high rate of speed. He says that's not what happened. I don't get in trouble. I'm 38 years old. I got too much to lose to be getting in trouble. We checked his record, and except for a few traffic tickets, Johnson has no history with police. He tells WREG he understands and respects what MPD is trying to accomplish, but believes this incident was taken too far and says the charges should be dropped. Everybody has something they like. I like to get in my old school classic car and, and take me away from the world. Mm -hmm. So everybody's not down there acting a fool. Now, Johnson was released on Sunday and is expected to appear in court in August. Meanwhile, Memphis police say they plan to continue with Operation Saturday Night Live until crime in the city becomes more at bay. For now, for your news leader, I'm Ashley Paul, WREG News Channel 3. All right, trying to make it safer. Thank you, Ashley.